My name is Wiala, aka the Lioness of Africa. I'm a singer, I'm a songwriter, I'm a dancer, I'm a performer. I'm a Sesala girl from the Upper West region of Ghana, Upper West to be precise, and I'm from a small uh, town called Funsi. The people of Funsi, we are Sesales and we speak Sesale. My mother is a Dagao, my father is a Sesala. And since we inherit from our father's side, I can say I'm from Funsi, so I'm a Sesala, but I also speak Dagari. So when I sing, I sing in English, Sesale and Dagari. We are going, heaven knows where we are going, but we know we will. So we are so we are so we are the plunkin, so we are the gekin. Hey, never see more than Tama. Yet a Jimbe Rajinayala. Yay, Massi, Carton Tuma, Matu, Ekundi, Kinamatu, Ekundi. Fonsi is uh, it's a small town with the population, uh, our population is about 2,000 plus currently, and almost everybody knows everybody. Most of the people here are farmers, both men and women. It's like the first occupation when you are growing up. We've all visited the farm. There's no child or young man or woman in Fosi that never did farming or doesn't do farming. And where the families here are usually large and everybody's everybody's cousin, uh, niece. So most of us here cannot marry within. That's how related we are. It's just the families that went out to build their own houses and then started their own family. So if you want to marry and you are really from Funsi, you have to go to another village. Even though you might end up marrying your cousin or your sister, which we don't allow here. Uh, the town is still developing. We have uh, the government schools here, few schools here, and the missionary school, which I went to, that was St. John's. And yeah, that's Fonsi. The people are friendly, Fonsi are friendly. <laughs> we love to meet new people. When we see a stranger, we are very inquisitive. We want to find out what you are doing, in our town and we want to make friends with you because we believe that if you make friends with strangers and you offer them help you just don't know what might happen tomorrow it might be your turn so we believe in do to others what you like to be done to you so we we are able to take care of strangers and we and they are very welcome our main food teaset which is tuozafi fufu which is also called kapala we call it kapala here and then the teaser too we say kolon we call it kolon or when you go into more of our traditional food, we have the dumpo, we have the tumpani or kara, we have the pogulo, and we have uh, different kinds of traditional food here. Uh, but these are the main ones as well. You can you can really feel the culture in Funsi through the lifestyle of the people, the way we greet, the way we solve our uh, uh, family and community problems, the way we marry, the way we dance. We still keep a, a lot of this happening. So that's when you can actually feel the culture. We don't have a lot of uh, tourist attraction site for you to see. We have one, which is the Fonsi Art Village, but our main culture experience that you can feel part of and see will be the dancing, and when we are getting married, or when the child is born, the naming ceremonies, and chieftaincy in skinning. Mostly we farm yam, corn, and millet. These are our champion areas when it comes to farming. And you will see a man can marry as many wives as you want. It is very normal here. So this is one of the communities where you can marry more and you can have more children. 
because we believe when you have more children, it means you are rich. Because even if you are not uh, f uh, uh, financially rich, but your children in the future, when they make it, you have made it. And they say, human beings are wealth. So, this is Fonsi. Enjoy the view. <laughs>